Hello and very good afternoon. Today I'm going to share with you how to analyze this data. Uh, first of all, as you can see here, you have five um, questions on each domain. So the question will be, um, what is the algorithm involved in this analysis before you can proceed to this correlation? So if you want to analyze this data, first you need to transform this thing into the numerical condition. So how we are going to do this? First, I need to look into your data. So you are using the Likert scale. Uh, this is Likert scale, not Likert item scale. Um, it's okay. You get one through five, blah, 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 blah. So how you want to analyze? You need to transform first. So you want to compute. The first one will be the salary based on your question. This is the salary, right? So you just uh, here mean mean from the question one until question three, three, four, and five. So usually what I did is I'm going to uh, use the paste button to generate the syntax. Why I generate the syntax? Because I want to make my life easier so that I proceed with the next one will be the salary. This one, the next one will be the advance. Depends what I'm not sure. I guess help me to figure out. Uh, what is this all about? So um, this one you can manipulate accordingly, but um, I don't like to be like this. So actually, if I analyze your data, first of all, I'm going to change all these things in it. So Q1 until Q5, um, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, something like that. So I'm going to split it into a different category code. Um, I mean, section based on this this is five questions about the salary uh, this is the five questions about the advance and growth conditions of performance job blah, blah blah so that's how you want to do just click here compute and then you can just click here okay and then one variable will um, appear here similarly go to the next uh, analysis you can just go here transform compute the next one is the advance right? advance and then you go here and then you change it accordingly so i cannot use the syntax easier so i'm going to change this method by using this numerical idea much more easier than this so this one is advance so i believe you put here because you want to make sure that we do not mix this thing right okay so for the one question here recognition is recognition so this one is work it Okay, this one I'm not sure. Same as what goes to this. Just go here and then you can just go to work it. Means uh, in in column, in semicolon. And then you choose it, work it, comma, work it, comma, work it also, comma, work it. Okay, the next one will be the transform compute for the quality. Quality is the same as well. So how we want to do it? Quality is okay. so the work it finish already. Quality, comma, quality, comma. So it's finished. So, so the next one will be the transform, transform, compute. Um, after the quality is the policy. So this is the policy. Same as this. So mean work it, comma, quality, policy, policy. Comma policy policy. Okay, whichever data involved in the computational element of each of the domain you must do compute. Okay, so I can just enter percent. So I can enter percent. Enter percent. Comma, comma. So basically, it's finished. So I'm going to continue this thing after this. So if you want to do the correlation, just go to correlate by the red. And then see identify which one is the ID and DV and then go here and then click OK. So come out this I think. Okay, that's all guys. See you again.